Hi everyone, this is my 10 years green card and I'm going to open this envelope to see my new card. As you remember guys, year 2021 when I arrived here in USA, after 7 months I received my 2 years green card. Then I need to file a removal of condition, the form I-751 to get the 10 years green card. But before I receive this 10 years green card, there is a lot of process. I encourage you, my beloved viewers, to take a look at my playlist, the CR1 Spousal Visa, for you to get some more information about me on my immigration journey here. Okay, while I am opening this envelope, I'm going to share with you the timeline. As I mentioned earlier, I need to submit an application, the I-751, to remove my condition. And I sent that a month of April 12 last year before the expiration of my two years green card. April 12, 2023, I submitted my I-751. Then April 19, uh, the status is they are actively reviewing my case. So adjudicating all of my paperwork. And you know what? Bef while they are reviewing my my application they sent me um extension letter which is i made also a video on that the 48 months extension so i was thinking about i'm gonna use that when i traveled but you know what god is good very timely the 10 years green card was arrived last wednesday which is it took like 11 months from the time that i submitted my i-751 then 11 months right now i received my 10 years green card all right so um yeah april um april <laughs> april 19 they are actively reviewing my paperwork then march 19 when i double check my uh uscis account which is this year march 19 the case was approved right and then at the same time when the case was approved March 19, they produce, they are producing my new card. So production for the new card. Then the following days, they produce my new card. So the card was produced. Then um, after two days, April 1st, the card was delivered to the post office. And then I pick up my uh, card of April 3rd, which is Wednesday last wednesday and here you go i can show you my this is actually my two years green card this one and the 10 years green card now of course you will receive this paper welcome to the united states and this is all the papers inside the envelope and they send us um, a small paper same thing with this one uh, they recommend to use this card holder. So we're, we're going to take it off. Take it off. Okay. And here you go. This is my 10 year screen card. Yep. We need to make sure that all the information here was uh, written correctly. The name, you know, country of birth, the birthday. Otherwise, we need to contact them or send back the, the green card to fix it. But I'm glad there's nothing wrong on my card. All the information is right. And then the category now is IR1 visa, which is before this one is um, CR1. This one, the new card is IR1. Wow, the expiration is until 2034. <laughs> but before this one uh what's next if we receive this 10 years green card there's a lot of videos that we can cope out what will be the next right but after receiving the 10 years green card uh, we are going to file a citizenship after three years of staying here in usa after three years, then we can submit an application for naturalization. Here you go. I'm going to show it to you. This is my two years green card, the CR1 visa. And this is my 10 years green card, the IR1 visa.
Okay. I'm waiting for this moment. I got it. And perfectly, I am all set. I'm going to travel in in uh, in the Philippines, our hometown, using this 10 years green card instead of carrying those uh, extension letter. One of you were asking about what is the service center who is handling my application, the I-751 removal of condition. When I take a look on my documents at the bottom left side, it is the National Benefit Center, which is in Missouri. I believe they are the one who are adjudicating or reviewing my paperwork. And I hope I answer your questions. So that's all for today, guys. I'm just like glad and giving you some timeline for you to see how long you're gonna take you're gonna receive your green card as well okay share your story as well and let's do some engagement and let's build up some friendship here in this platform i'm so glad uh, for you guys for your constant support for being here and i'm sharing this the purpose of my video is to help also my co uh, applicants who are filing their own papers and i hope you find always this video helpful i will keep you an updated and posted with you and uh thank you so much for all the comments that uh you know i am learning also from you guys for those information that you inputted there on my channel and i'm gonna visit you also in your channel and i hope um we have a successful and productive and safe um staying here in usa okay all right so i'm gonna see you on my next vlog guys and i need to let you go now thank you for watching and please don't forget to subscribe and click the bell for more notification like this video if you like <laughs> all right thank you so much and see you in my next video bye bye